Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Yuki here. Today's video, I have a fall haul. I've had these pieces in my cart for a while and I finally pulled the trigger. I'm really excited to show you guys what I got. This haul is gonna be a little bit different. I'm gonna be putting together some outfits with each of the pieces that I bought so you can see how I would style it. Just like give you a little bit more inspiration on how to actually put these things together in an outfit. I hope you enjoyed this format. If you do, please don't forget to subscribe and also follow me on Instagram. I post a lot of my outfits on there as well. So without further ado, let's get right into the first item. The first thing I want to show you guys is the Rebecca sweater. It's a cropped turtleneck sweater with a little bit of a balloon sleeve detailing and if you watch my other hauls you know how much I love a sweater with a good balloon sleeve. I got it in size medium because I like my crop sweaters to be a little bit more oversized. I think it's just a personal preference of mine. That's why I got it in a size medium. It doesn't fit super oversized so if you kind of want this fit I would also consider sizing up. Is it the most practical purchase? No, but is it really cute? Definitely. It looks really nice with a pair of like high-waisted bottoms. You'll see that I'm styling it with some high-waisted dark wash mom jeans, which is a great look for fall. I also throw in a pair of flat combat boots, and I think it's just such a nice fall outfit. You can throw a camel coat over it or a shirt jacket. Super cute sweater. Another thing I want to point out about this sweater, when I was buying it, I wasn't sure if it was like a raw hem. Now that I have it, I can see the finished hem, even though it's made to look like it was just cut. So if you wash it, um, it's not going to unravel on you, hopefully. It doesn't seem like it would. So yeah, that was the first piece. So I know this isn't the most practical winter purchase, but it's definitely good for those warmer days where you can just wear this with a pair of over the knee boots, sweater, and a jacket. This one is in a size four. I love the pleated detail. I love the green check for my outfit. I got this with the Rebecca sweater that you saw earlier with my combat boots, which is more of like an edgy, casual outfit. I also thought it would be really cute to style with like a white tank top and my black oversized blazer and a pair of like over the knee boots just to show you kind of a more dressy, elevated outfit for the fall as well. It's really cute. I don't really have a lot of skirts so it was fun to try this one out. Just the color and style of this makes it such a great basic to style for the fall and also in the summer as well. The next thing I have to show you guys is a half zip sweater. This one is by T&A and it's in a size small. It just makes me feel like I'm going to a cottage or I'm going on a ski trip or something like that. It just has that kind of feeling to it and I really like that it's cropped and it also has like a little drawstring hem so you can tighten it or loosen it depending on what you want your outfit to look like and this one just looks so so cute so casual my style is very like easy casual and I think that this is perfect addition to my personal style for the outfit I styled it with the same dark wash mom jeans that I wore with the Rebecca sweater and my combat boots and I think it's just such a cute outfit super warm once again and just a really great basic for the next item, I got a pair of beige linen trousers. These are wide leg trousers. They're high-waisted and they're just a really like easy, breezy pair of pants. This one is by Wilfred and I got it in a size four. And I just love the way that this was styled on the model on the website. This pair of pants hangs really nice on the body. It's super flowy, super breezy. I really like the fit and I was just really curious about it. I styled it with my black tank top with some shoulder pads so that it kind of balances out how wide the legs are. And I paired it with a black shoulder bag. I styled it with my beige Allbirds sneakers. They're my favorite wool sneakers. Great outfit for like warmer fall days. And I think this item will even style really well going into the spring and summer just because it's linen and it's like a breezy, really casual, relaxed material. So the next item I have to show you, plunge cardigan. I finally, finally got one. I got this one in an extra small because they actually ran out of the small for this color. My my normal size is again a small but you can definitely size down I think and there will be no problem. This one is super super cute. It has the balloon sleeve detailing once again. The waist cinches in and really helps highlight that hourglass figure. I think that it looks so cute with a pair of high-waisted jeans. Really really cute. Great to wear on its own or with a tank top but if you are wearing it on its own you definitely need to like tape it down with something because it will like pop out. So that's just something to keep in mind. So if you watch my Aritzia loungewear 
Uber haul, you'll see that I got a bunch of sweatpants just to test out the different fits and also to kind of show you guys what the difference is between all the different models and the fits and the style. I did that, but none of the pieces I picked up, I was 100% happy with. I wanted a set, like a matching sweatshirt, sweatpants set. Got the boyfriend sweatpants with the matching sweatshirt, but I didn't like the rise of the boyfriend sweatpants. I just didn't think it was high enough and I just knew that I wasn't gonna be happy with it in the long run. So I exchanged those and I reordered the boyfriend hoodie and the mega fit sweatpants. And I am so happy with these. This is the set, you guys. Like this is the one. This time I just decided to go with classic Gray. This one is actually the Heather Chrome because I know they have a bunch of different gray options but it's like a lighter gray and it's a little bit heathered and I got the Mega Fit sweatpants. This one I also talked about in my loungewear haul. It's a Mega Fit sweatpant. That was my favorite and I got it in a size extra small. Still kind of oversized so I would definitely size down if you wanted that like high rise oversized baggy look without it being too baggy. I'm really excited to wear this out. I think it's such a perfect set to wear together with like a cross body bag and a wool coat over it. Really, really glad that I exchanged my pieces for this one. I just think that I'll be able to get so much more wear out of the gray ones. Okay, so this brings me to the very last item. I think you guys know what it is. Super buff jacket. I actually got it in the high gloss version in the white and I also got it in the original size. So this is what it looks like. Super cute. It actually wasn't as puffy as I was expecting. I think it's really flattering. It definitely is on the pricier side but there's a lot of different technical features in this coat you have a hidden pocket inside which is good for like your phone button closure pocket and it's actually lined with fleece super soft super cozy and i also really like that the cuff has like a little hole for your thumb one thing that i wish would be different about this coat was that I wish the hood was actually larger because I feel like it doesn't really cover my entire head. I think this hood is also detachable as well. I'm still considering whether I should keep this one or go for the same color in the long version. Just because that one is warmer, this one will definitely, if you live in a snowy climate, it'll definitely keep you warm. All right, you guys, so that was my Aritzia fall picks for the Black Friday sale. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give this video a like, subscribe to my channel, and leave me a comment on which one was your favorite. I hope you guys enjoy the styling portion of the try on haul let me know if you end up trying any of these pieces out follow me on instagram i post a lot of my daily outfits on there as well that's it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed and as always i hope you guys have a really great week and i'll see you in my next video